I say might have. You can't make this up. Oh, this, I, I have to walk away from this. I can't do it. I can't do it. <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. There's no way. There's no way. Okay, so there's new love coming here, Pisces. I just have to say it. There is. Because they don't like to use protection, those of you that are capable of having children through sexual means, you need to be careful because with the Six of Cups there and the Chariot, you're both very fertile and you very much can have uh, offspring. You can. So you need to be very careful if that is not your intention, Pisces. This energy is ripe for baby making, okay? This energy is very ripe. Person meets you where you're pursuing work, where you're pursuing your business, where you're mastering your craft, mastering your skills, okay, Pisces? Hello, my beautiful Pisces. Welcome back to the channel. Starseed Zayad here. If you're new, please make sure to subscribe and join the Soul Tribe. We have a reading for you guys. This is a general reading for October 2021. So anything goes in this reading. So because of this, certain messages may resonate, some may not. So take what resonates, leave what doesn't behind. Energies are interchangeable and the timelines are really crazy right now. So because of that, I advise everybody to read the disclaimer in the description box below. And for those of you interested in a personal reading, you can check the link tree link in the description box below or go on your browser and type www.starseedsire.com and it will be in the shop tab. So we have the King of Cups, we have the Four of Wands in reverse. Thank you so much, angels, ancestors, spirit guides, universe. What do you see for my Pisces this October? Truly grateful for all your messages. Thank you. Page of Pentacles, the lovers, the moon. Okay, so there's new love coming here, Pisces. I just have to say it. There is. Um, and this person wants to take things fast with you. They want to take things fast with you. Holy crap. They want to get married. You have the chariot and the six of cups. Oh, this is so cute. They want to get married. They want to have kids or adopt kids. Okay. This is for everybody. Heterosexual, homosexual, uh, okay, bisexual, whatever your preference, whatever your gender, this is for everybody, okay, we don't discriminate around here, but yeah, they want a family, but you guys, you guys just don't have the funds for a house yet, four of wands in reverse, damn, that sucks, you're trying to get help here, so you and this new person are going to meet in October, it's so interesting that you have the the moon when the previous full moon was pisces but you have the moon you have page of pentacles and you have the lovers this is a new person i feel like a lot of you are because it is the pentacles a lot of you are going to meet this person like i always say in these videos either in school in college or university while you're studying or you can meet them at the job at your internship Okay, if you're, um, you know, you're trying to, you know, you want to do a, like a, an art business and you're taking art classes at a local art shop, you might meet this person there, okay? If you're starting an Etsy shop, okay, you might meet this person there. It has something to do with career, something to do with business, okay? Um, it could be anything, really. It could be, you know, depending on your circumstance. It could really be anywhere, you know, if you go to the library to write your blog or to the coffee shop okay you could meet this person there this person meets you where you're pursuing work where you're pursuing your business where you're mastering your craft mastering your skills okay pisces that's where this person meets you and they want to take things very fast with you okay very sexual uh they want to go fast okay they don't like using protection pisces i just have to say it you need to be careful, okay? They don't like using protection. They're a little bit on the freakier side, I will say that. Uh, they like having fun. They like using toys. Um, this is turning into an 18 plus reading. Well, it, I, I'm not going to go into specifics, but they're very adventurous, okay? The woods, the beach, the mountainside, the cliff tops, 
you get what I'm saying. The desert, okay? They want to take you everywhere, okay? Now, this Six of Cups, it could be... Uh, it, this could also represent somebody... It may not be from your hometown, but they could be from uh, the same state or the same country that you grew up in. Or they could have some relation, like their their mom was born there, okay? Like, they, they could have some sort of affiliation to, to that. I don't think it's anybody from your past, like from your elementary school or middle school, high school. I don't, I don't think that. Um, it, it feels very new. It feels like they could go fast, and it feels like because they don't like to use protection, those of you that are capable of having children through sexual means, you need to be careful because with the Six of Cups there and the Chariot, you're both very fertile and you very much can have uh, offspring. You can. So you need to be very careful if that is not your intention, Pisces. This energy is ripe for baby making, okay? This energy is very ripe for those of you that can, uh, you know, get pregnant. The, the energy is very, very ripe. Very ripe, okay, for kids. This person, it's so sweet. They love you, Pisces. This person loves you. They do. They want to offer their cup in love, but they don't have money to buy you a house, sadly. <laughs> That's okay, though. I feel like you guys will get there. But, yeah, they want to offer their cup in love. They truly desire you. You're like a dream come true to them. Wow, you can't make this up. Look at that. The Two of Cups. This is beautiful. Your Twin Flames. You are. You might have been together in a past life. I say might have. You can't make this up. Oh, this... I, I have to walk away from this. I can't do it. I can't do it. <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. There's no way. There's no way. Roll roll the tape. Rewind. Rewind. Because people are going to say, oh, you planned this. No, I didn't plan anything. Two of Cups and the Ace of Cups and the Lovers. Uh, these readings, I, I can't. I swear, I watch other tarot readers... But my readings, especially after late, and I'm not even bragging, my readings have been, like, the the stuff that I pull and, and comes out, it's just, I, I can't even explain it. How many times does this happen on this channel? And I, I literally, um, the, other, the other morning I woke up, it was 555. I'm like, bro, <laughs> I keep seeing the numbers and the synchronicities. You tell me. You tell me. What else from my Pisces, since they're about to fall in love? What else we have here? Eight of Cups. You're going to walk with this person. You're going to move somewhere. You're going to start a new life somewhere with them. Five of Cups. You're moving forward. Yeah, you're you're walking away. You're no longer focused on, on whatever situation you had. Your whole life is about to change, it really feels like, when you meet this person. Um... This person doesn't feel like they follow tradition. And what I mean by that is I feel like they don't uh, really care to work a 9 to 5. I'm not saying that they... It feels to me like they have money saved up. But I feel like they just want to travel with you. And there's judgment. There's judgment. So judgment is like if, you know... It's kind of like the tower except with judgment... It's like those who are ready for this shift, those who are ready for this change, they're going to welcome it with open arms. Whereas those who don't want to change or those who want to stay in the same, they are going to slowly struggle until they collapse, essentially. But Eight of Cups and Five of Cups, it's like whatever you've been through, there has been a lot of focus on that. But now when you meet this person, you're going to walk away. You're going to walk away. Um, and it feels like there's a lot of travel here. Feels like there's a lot of travel here, Pisces. What can I say? 
I feel like a wide variety of heights if they're male. Like, they could be 5 foot 5 to 6 foot 3. Like, they could, you know, wide variety of heights. I'm getting different skin tones as well. Um, for a lot of you, I'm getting the name Michael. I'm getting Zach or Zachary. Arturo, which is a Spanish name, Arturo. Um, so I'm getting the letter L. Hmm. Seeing brown or, uh, it's like they're, they either have brown hair or they have jet black hair. And some of them are very light brown to the point where it's like, sometimes you think they're blonde, but they aren't blonde. I don't know. It's weird. It's weird. <laughs> but yeah, different shades of brown or jet black hair is what I'm saying here. I'm saying all skin tones. Yeah, look, you're you're going somewhere with them and death and rebirth. Your whole life changes. Your your whole life changes. This this is the end, okay? You have death and you have judgment. This is the end. What whatever Pisces, whatever you've been doing with your current life, everything is about to change. Everything is. Okay? There's the Knight of Swords, there's that person chasing after you. Okay, you and them both are going to walk away. Some of you may drop out of school. Uh, it really feels like you, you're you going to look at each other and you're going to know. Like something just activates within the both of you at a soul level. And you're going to know, wait a minute, we have a purpose to do here on this bitch. We got to get going. <laughs> we got to get going. Like the, the we're slowly approaching the the uh climax of this timeline on earth and we have a lot to get done we gotta get going and you both you both walk towards that goal i'm seeing costa rica i'm seeing panama okay there there's a huge like this is incredible you guys have a purpose here look at that three of cups new friendships but you guys both i will say here you're gonna meet new friends on your journeys you're gonna journey together very far and wide but i will say here pisces you and this twin flame you have a group of people watching over you okay a lot of ancestors ancient ancestors that are still alive and they're on spaceships hovering around earth okay they're watching over you they're prepared to do the unthinkable should anything happen to you or this person because they have the technology to save lives. They do. They're willing to expose themselves if it means saving your life, if your life is in danger. Same with this person. You are very important to the divine plan that God has on this planet. You guys are going to change this planet for the better. There is no doubt about it. You are. This is incredible. This is incredible. This is an incredible energy. Yeah, Seven of Cups. You know, a lot of times this is about choices. And I feel like <clears throat> they're trying to blo they're, <clears throat> they're attacking my throat chakra. They're trying to block it. But I won't be silenced. A lot of times this is about choices. And I feel like you guys are going to travel to a lot of different places. But I also feel like this is representing... <clears throat> everything that you and this person are going to do in this lifetime so your angels have a message for you and we're going to close out this incredible reading truly incredible what an energy i tell you that much ask for a sign ask for a sign and your angels will show it for you they will show ask for a sign pisces because that is going to be your confirmation of this reading. Ask your angels for a sign. Ask them. And they will confirm this reading is for you. They will confirm it. If you see 111, 222, 1222. <clears throat> 
I'm just saying. Ask them. Ask them for a sign. And they will show you the sign. And when they do, remember this reading. Okay? Remember this reading. Magician. Manifesting. Creating a higher timeline on this planet. Creating heaven on earth. It's happening. Wow. Incredible. Very incredible. So that is your reading, Pisces. Um, there's so much I want to say, but I'm not going to say it because I don't want to, you know, I, I don't want to steer like you away from the path that you are meant to follow. I worry that I may say certain things and, you know, so I'd rather just keep it at that. You're going to do big things in this world. So that is your reading. I hope you enjoyed it, and I wish you love and light and the best of luck. Take